Opportunities are endless in the markets. Stay tuned traders, we'll be right back. G'day traders, Stacy Burke from Stacy Burke Trading. Uh, as you may have noticed, I've been away for a few weeks and um, Daily Pip Talk is taking a break. I was uh, overseas, I was in uh, the States for uh, a week and a bit and down in Florida. Had the opportunity to uh, study some traders and um, watch them trade in live time and uh, just learn from some people who are trading bigger and better than me and then also get up to Canada and do the same thing and also catch up with family and uh, use that time uh, <clears throat> to see I guess uh, if there's a possibility we might be moving back to North America. My kids are a bit older and they were all born in Australia, but uh, everybody's sort of toying with the idea of going back. So it was a, a very uh, uh, successful, amazing trip. I got back last night from Dubai and uh, very refreshed and recharged and, and had my eyes opened up to just some of the stuff that's going on out there with other traders. And, uh, you know, I talk about listening to great podcasts daily, working on your mindset. We talk about this in the seven step daily routine for high performance traders. Every single day learning something new, listening to other traders, you know, um, chat with traders, better system trader, uh, 52 traders, just some great podcasts out there. But anyways, uh, went over and studied and had the chance to watch some traders trade live. Um, largely, tracking uh, market makers and stop hunting and and um, some pretty big trades uh, a lot bigger than me but um, that was the purpose in going and you know I've talked about really pushing size but it just amazes me the opportunities that exist in our markets and, and just you know this was currency but but like some of the traders that I observed was in the equities um, there's other traders I didn't I didn't watch them per se but they were trading other instruments futures and it's incredible. The learning never stops. And um, I'm hopefully going to be able to share a lot of that knowledge with you over the next few weeks. Uh, you know, I have a, a mantra that I always tell myself, invest, ILT, invest, learn and teach. And, um, you know, part of me going was I'm really pushing, getting my trades up to uh, what I consider to be significant size. And I wanted to spend some time with people who are doing that and watch them in live time. And um, that was a very powerful experience. So looking forward to sharing a lot of that with you, but I encourage all of the traders out there. I've received a ton of emails while I was gone. I didn't really have the best access to Wi-Fi while I was traveling. And I just decided to sort of take a step back and um, just relax and enjoy myself. I had a great opportunity to catch up with a lot of old friends back home uh, that I grew up with playing ice hockey and um, some of my classmates uh, from university and just really great time. Loved being back in North America. Um, although I love it in Perth, it's, uh, I'm not sure what, what we're gonna do. The only thing concern I had was the time zones for trading London. So <laughs> I had to get up early a couple mornings. But coming back to preparation, I really found that the biggest, uh, one of the biggest things that, that stuck with me was, you know, number one, having your game plan sorted well before you go to the screen. Uh, these traders that I watched spent a large majority of their time preparing for the next day's session and having their levels drawn out and, and having if then, if this, then that scenarios. Um, but they were very, very specific about what their trade setups were. And, um, you know, very easy, like relaxed, calm. Uh, when the opportunities presented, they had, a, you know, some, some of their, what I, you know, we talk about building your playbook, their eight best trade setups. And they went in heavy. And um, their stops were tight. And, <clears throat> you know, I just, again, we talk, it's, it, they're, it reinforces that there's not a lot of you know real rocket science to successful trading it's being prepared it's having a, a game plan having your your trading setups and the patience and discipline uh, to stick to that and when they come and you've honed those skills 
over time through hitting trades, you know, making mistakes, learning how to do it better, learning how to be more patient, you know, mastering the setup better, uh, mastering how to knowing when to go to break even, uh, trailing your, your position, how to set your profit targets. Um, it's a never ending journey of, of constant learning. Uh, but what you realize when you have the opportunity to do this with other traders who are doing it bigger and better is that um, that's all that they've done is they've gotten better and bigger at what they do well. So again, I, I challenge you to um, bulletproof yourself through your daily rituals. Identify where your, your successes, your best successes are with your trading in terms of your skill set, your ability to execute, your time frame, your time of day, all that, all that, you know, relative to where you're at in the globe. And then really focus on being patient enough to wait for those setups. Um, you know, there was trades every single day uh, that I observed. And uh, since I've come back and been able to study and review and trade, a little bit of trading while I was in Canada, um, things get clear. You, you have a uh, quantum leap. You know, you, you shift, you, you have a zone shift like in the markets. There's a change in your level of thinking. Uh, there's a change in your level, your skill level in executing your trades. And sometimes there, there's a, you know, a portal that you have to pass through. And, and sometimes there's a, you know, a part of that where you may not feel like you're seeing progress. But I can assure you if you're doing the right things that you're making progress. So hopefully you got some value from today's video traders. Opportunities are endless in the markets. And, um, you know, like we've talked about in other videos, uh, it's life changing. So I encourage you to go back to work if you're frustrated, if you're not getting the results that you want. Simplify things. Build a daily routine. Focus on one or two setups. Learn to master them. Learn how to do them better. Learn how to keep your losses small and constant. And then learn how to do it bigger and better and extract the most out of your winning trades as you can. Keep your losses limited. Stay focused and stay disciplined and develop the patience to wait for those trading setups. And when they come, hit them hard. So have a great weekend traders. Looking forward to uh, getting back into the routine. Already had uh, my dogs out this morning. Well, my dog out this morning. Unfortunately, uh, my, my other dog's ashes have been cremated and delivered to us now. So. But uh, over the next few weeks, hopefully to pass on some of the nuggets that I uh, made copious amounts of notes. And hopefully we'll be able to sh demonstrate some of that in the charts. Uh, some great stuff that I think will apply to all markets. Uh, this was mainly currency. But I think it's um, going to be a lot of great value for everyone. So have a great weekend, traders. And may the markets go with you. Hi, traders. It's Stacy Burke from Stacy Burke Trading. If you haven't done so, please head over to my website at stacyburktrading.com. I create updates on almost a daily basis and I would love for you to receive them. Just click on the blog. If you want to enter your name and your email address, I'll send you my free audio program, The 7 Step Daily Routine for High Performance Traders. This is essential knowledge for all traders in all markets and this is for helping traders to master the market with discipline, confidence and a winning mindset. I appreciate all your feedback and comments. As always, traders, stay disciplined and may the markets go with you.